Okay, so this is November 14th, 2022. Great catching uh, front cover here. So many titles that catch your attention. It's Thanksgiving Made Easy, No More Tiredness, News that re the reason 90% of women over 50 need more vitamin B12 is the best way to boost your level. Lose 95% belly fat with this ice cream. Fast cures brain fog, blue moods, joint pain, GI problems. Discovered that holiday spice kills 99.9% .9 of cold and flu viruses instantly. Thicker hair now. Seven easy at home and color tricks that make your hair look thicker, lusher, the one that works just for you. Just in time, expert advice for sidestepping family tension, holiday tension. Heal your liver, lose your belly, drop two pounds a day. Alert, little known nutrition shortfall causing liver damage for 80% of all of us. Ohio State research reveals the delicious remedy that will heal your liver for more, 10 times more the fat burning without dieting. Yes, genius ways to double your kitchen space. And the top corner, wow your crowd, hi there, happy. Shania Twain shares her three minute secret to feeling great all day. Now, as you can tell, many jam packed articles, great book, I highly suggest you pick it up, but I'm only gonna share two parts of this book with you. I know everybody's going, oh no, share more than that. Well, life made easy, 10 brilliant uses for wax paper. Now the first one is help cheese stay fresh longer. Now my niece loves cheese, so I hope she's paying attention. Help cheese stay fresh longer. Whenever you buy cheese to make a sh surgery board, the leftover blocks always seem to spoil before you can enjoy them. The save, double wrap and block first in wax paper, then in aluminum foil. The paper wicks away the mold causing moisture while the foil keeps the block from drying out. So fresh cheese keeps for up to a week and aged cheese for over a month. You can quiet a shower curtain rod. Eek, every time someone in your family moves the curtain, get in and out of the shower, you hear the ear piercing squeak to the rescue wax paper. Just rub the, rub the rod with a sheet of wax paper. The waxy coating lubricates the rod so the curtain glides smoothly and quietly. Ah. Three, lift stuck on candle wax. Now, if the taper candles you displayed on your Thanksgiving table dripped on your tablecloth, try this to remove it. Place a piece of wax paper coated side down over the spill and rub it with a warm iron set too low to gather the iron's heat and the paper's waxy coating will cause two waxes to stick together so the candle residue comes up with the paper. Easily recork any bottle. Now you have a half used bottle of wine and you want to save it, but you can't get the cork back in. Since wine corks expand when they expose to air, which makes it tough to recork, cut out a three inch square wax paper, then place over the bottle opening, then push the cork into the bottle. The wax will lubricate the cork so it slides back into place. Bonus if the cork breaks apart when you go to pull it out again, the wax paper will catch any cork bits. Help de-gunk de a can opener. Ugh, grime and food splatters stuck between the gears of your can opener are keeping it from working properly. What can help? Place a sheet of wax paper between the blades and run that paper, and run the tool, sorry, as if you were opening a can. The thick paper will remove the gunk, while the wax will lubricate the wheels. Banish stubborn water spots. Now the trick to nix water spots and fingerprints from the bathroom fixture rub a piece of wax paper coated side down over the chrome surface repeat weekly the paper will buff away the spots while the wax will act like a clear varnish to help make the chrome sparkle save a soaked coffee table book your cat knocked the glass of water over onto your favorite coffee table book save the day with wax paper to do, after blotting away the excess water with a paper towel, slip sheets of wax paper between the wet pages. If possible, strand the book on end, stand the book on end until it's dry. The paper's water repellent coating will keep the pages from sticking and let the air circulate for faster drying. Make a waxed floor sparkle. 
Guests are due soon and you notice that your wax floor is looking a bit dingy. The quick save, wax paper. After using two, after sweeping, use two rubber bands to attach a sheet of wax paper coated side down over the head of a sponge or Swiffer style mop. Then run the mop head back and forth over the floor a few times. The resulting friction will transfer wax to the floor for a beautiful shine. Splatter proof your mixer. Now it's such a pain to get clean splattered batter off your counter and walls and after you whip out your pumpkin cookie dough. To avoid the mess, tear off a sheet of wax paper so it extends only a few inches over the mixing bowl. Poke the beaters through the paper. Mix as normal. The paper will act as a splattering guard, keeping the batter in a bowl where it belongs. Nix static from your pet's fur. Dry indoor air at this time of year means your, you and your fluffy friend, cat or dog, get a stack, static shock every time that you pet him. The minimize the ouch, enlist the help of wax paper. Just share off a sheet of kitchen style staple and rub it all over his body. Repeat as needed. Then this lightly coat with a fur with the wax. Oh goodness. Uh, while nixing the static and any resulting shocks. And you'll feel be able to cuddle your pal worry free. Donnie, are you starting to get tired? No. And, of course, everybody's favorite, the horoscope. Now, this is October 20th through November 14th, so it's about up. Here we go. If you are a Scorpio from October 23rd to November 21st, from October 23rd on, the confident sun moves through your sign Bordering your vitality and self-assurance. Excuse me. Take charge on a long-term personal goal. You'll be unstoppable in around October 25th. Asserting your needs with a loved one could be particularly, empower particularly empowering. Dive in. Can you tell I'm a little tired? Sagittarius. November 22nd through December 21st. You'll be compelled to carve out your more family time from October 30th on. Bonding can lead to gratitude. Then come October 31st, Mars is retrograding your 7th house of partnership. Consider how you will exert your energy to preempt your burnout. Capricorn, December 22nd through January 19th. On October 22nd, you will find it easy to share plans with people you respect and admire. They'll applaud you and your efforts. Then around October 24th, the confident sun moves through your 11th house of networking and collaborating with friends or colleagues will set you up for success. Aquarius. On October 27th, oh, that's January 20th through February 18th. On October 27th, you may have an epiphany related to your goals. A novel approach can bring recognition. And while go-getter, Mars and in retrograde in your fifth house, of self-expression from October 30th on, being forthcoming about your feelings will lead to fulfillment. And Pisces. Come on. My nose is itching. February 19th through March 20th. Get out of your comfort zone and hone your skill set. Ideally, alongside a friend from October 20th on. Then, while Jupiter moves through your sign from October 28th on, Passionate projects are sure to get a boost. Thinking positively lays the groundwork for a win. Aries. And that's March 21st through April 19th. You'll find partnering with a dear friend comes naturally on October 21st. You're already in sync. And from October 30th on, action-oriented Mars, retrograding your third house of communication, presents an opportunity to pour your energy into projects that are in line with your aspirations. Taurus, that is April 20th through May 20th. Around October 25th, shakeups and relationships inspire you to speak your truth. You could be headed for healing. Come November 9th when the lunar eclipse and full moon fall into your sign. Take time to care for your emotions, which will be coming to surface now. Gemini, May 21st through June 20th. Around October 25th, look out for a breakthrough related to your wellness routine. Then from October 30th on, Mars moves backward through your sign, making it tougher than usual to move the ball forward onto your to-dos. Being intentional with your energy can make for results. 
Cancer. That's June 21st through July 22nd. Dive into your more artistic endeavors while Venus moves through your fifth house of self-expression from October 24th on. Involving loved ones can make for a memorable moment and come October 25th, you may be empowered to move more strongly, embrace what makes you unique. Sexy, sassy Leo, that's me, July 23rd through August 22nd. From October 23rd on, the sun moves through your fourth house of home life, shining the light on your inner world. Enjoy this time-honored tradition that brings you bliss. Come November 8th, shake up your approach to achieving big picture goals. It will surely bring you joy. Virgo, August 23rd through September 22nd. While Mercury moves through your third house of communication from October 29th on, your calendar will be packed. Timeouts for self-care can help you feel firing on all cylinders while no around November 5th, you might be stirring to break free from mundane routines. Take a leap of faith now. Libra, September 23rd through October 22nd. On October 22nd, the confident sun pairs up with the artistic Venus in your sign. A perfect day for getting as creative or spending extra time with loved ones then from october 23rd on trading notes with money making project with friends can lead you down a promising path and that's the only two things i want to share from this great book but i want you to pick it up and experience it yourself so thank you for tuning in with first for women november 14th 2022